To what you've been waiting for, Kike, all week long. What was I waiting for? Oh, okay. Long. Uh, the weekly loser news. Um. The and this week we got it out other than that shit show of the Amber Turd and Johnny mm-hmm. Depp fucking trial. And here we, I'm just looping this thing of this bitch being such a fake. Uh, <laughs> Pretending to be sad and then laughing and smiling and trying to get back into character. Oh, yes, I'm an actress. Let me act like I'm sad and disappointed. She can't even do it. She's not a really good actress. To she looks honest. like shit. She looks like she hasn't slept. Uh, but anyways, we're going to go She's over. probably hung over. Just a few of the things that were said and done this week and shit. Because this is everybody's talking about this. There's, a, there's, there's all these videos that Johnny Depp turned in from the security cams where... They were still married, but they were separated in the process of a divorce. And this bitch is literally taking Elon Musk with that little Carol Divine Yingy or whatever her name is, you know, fucking Enchantress from Suicide Squad. He's taking her and Elon Musk to the hotel, to, to his apartment to fuck in the threesome. And another time, she also goes up there with James Franco to also fuck and do drugs and shit. This is all while they're still married. All right. And then uh, they also show uh, Johnny Depp's text messages to Paul Bettany. Kike. Oh, yeah. What, what do they say? The vision. They say that uh, in, in he was because he was mad and he had already kicked her out. And Paul yeah. Bettany was asking him, are you going to let her back in? And he'd be like, I'll set her on fire before I let her back in my house. That's one. <laughs> she already response. fucked me twice. I was taking a shower and she fucking kicked the door and. It's just like what the fuck? Yeah, 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 <laughs> shit like that. And then another, tra- another, another, another message he says, "I'll fuck, I'll fuck her, 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 her dead corpse to make sure she's dead." But that's oh, shit. no, but to make sure the witch is dead. But that's from my, Monty Python, and he was just talking oh, yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. He was just talking shit with uh, Paul Bettany, making fun of Mon- Monty Python. Oh, you mean like the shit that we do here in the show? Yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> <laughs> the defense. They came after him, dude. Yeah. And they're all uh, like, yeah. were you with Marilyn Manson uh, doing marijuana and cocaine? And he's like, well, well yes. Yes, I was. And then he was like, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And then they, they, they ask him, uh, what about, what about uh, cocaine, uh, these pills? You, you took some pills. And he, and he goes, well, I gave Marilyn Manson a pill so he can shut up because he was talking too much. <laughs> And everybody burst out laughing, bro. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, by the way, that's fucking has nothing to do with a fucking relationship that we're yeah. already separated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It has nothing to do with their fucking conflict. There's a bunch of fucking shit that they said over the phone that he recorded. Yeah. And in by any means. Or even she's saying, I wasn't punching you, I was hitting you. And he's all okay. like, and he's all like, hey, I'm just trying to. Just go away to the bathroom away from you and you just keep following me and egging on and I'm trying to de-escalate things and you just keep coming and she goes, no, because you have to finish the fight. When you start, you finish. <laughs> and she's telling you, yelling at him. You I'll have to finish it. Yeah. I gotta finish. I gotta finish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> at one point, yeah, at one point, he she threw a vodka bottle at him and it broke everywhere and the glass cut his, the tip of his finger off. He can't, Jesus he's, fucking He's Christ. missing the tip of his finger. He went to the hospital and he lied and he told the doctor, hey, Two don't... Children? Yeah, yeah. He, 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 he lied. He told the doctor what happened, but he told the doctor, don't say anything, please. Like, just go to my house yeah. and pick up the tip of my finger and tell me if you can sew it back on. The yeah. doctor went to the house and found the finger and brought it back and shit. Um, yeah, yeah, Dude. yeah. Did you see that video where he's talking to, like, he's dressed up as fucking, like, Captain fucking, I don't remember his name. Yeah, Jack Sparrow. Uh, Jack Sparrow. 
and uh, he's with children. He's helping children that are sick, bro. And he's like in full character. And one of the girls was like, hey, what happened to your finger? And he's like, well, uh, I had to eat it. I was hungry. I was uh, stranded in the island. You know, like he was fucking like still in character, bro. Like that's fucking hardcore, man. I mean, how can you fucking like that guy's a fucking legend, man. I don't know, man. Mine might be biased. Yeah. Regardless. Yeah, time, hang on. I fucking heard all this fucking like recordings and shit. Regardless man. of whether he's this. doing it. Yeah. Regardless of whether he's doing drugs and, 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 and drinking and shit like that. She's the crazy one. Yeah. She's that shit crazy. And I tell you, all right, we said already in the comments, keep care. This is what happens when you're 50 years old and you go out with a 20 year old. Or, no, she, you she, marry. You're ma- no, at that time, when they, when they were yeah. married, he was in his 50s, and she was like in her 20s, probably in her late 20s, but it doesn't matter. She was in her 20s. A 20-year-old to a 50-year-old has not matured enough, bro. Yeah, no, That's no, why no, I would no, say, you that shit. if you're 50, yeah, yeah 30 I'm with year old, you, bro. a 30-year-old is fine if you're 50, yeah. but not a 20-year-old. Yeah. That person's yeah. not like... Well, not saying? even a 30-year-old, man. I mean, come on, man. They, they literally nah, I've dated fucking people that are like that crazy, dude. Yeah, some 30-year-olds are still some yeah. crazy bitches. Some of them, on, yeah, man. some crazy bitches. Yeah, hey, come get, on, man. hey, I fucking... They, they even showed a picture of her at a bar with Kevin Nash mm-hmm. from wrestling. All fucking all over him and shit. All while she was with him. So she's a little hoe, dude. She was a little hoe back then. And the only yep. reason she's famous, the truth is, because she married him. She nobody before him. Yeah, you know what? I never heard of her about her until this shit came yeah. out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But okay, we're gonna move on because this is gonna continue yeah. next week. They're gonna spill on yeah. to next week. This is gonna be the whole yeah, team. There's a lot for, more shit about the next this, six man. months. But well, here we go, man. The loser news continued. Oh my god! Kick, hey, hey, Kylo, take it easy. Hey. <laughs> take it easy. <laughs> take it on jobs and shit. <laughs> Foreigners. Anyways, you get the losers. We continue with the losers of the week. All right. And continue with the losers. This week is everyone that went to Coachella. (laughs) Yeah, yeah. Because all these woke ass kids are born after 1997. Mm. They got to go yeah, to their yeah. fucking uh, their their Coachella concerts with their fucking neon green hair and their pink, neon pink. My hair. God, I gotta get a Coachella. It's gonna be so fucking red. All the girls yeah. were all the girl, the overweight girls were wearing lingerie and shit, and all the woke ass <laughs> motherfuckers. <laughs> yeah, all the woke ass <laughs> motherfuckers. <laughs> Were in Hawaiian yeah. shirts and it was dope as fuck. But when they got there, they were disappointed. Kike. What happened? I have not been following well, this. There was long lines to get in. Oh, they said really? oh. super long lines. The concession oh, stands were long lines to buy anything, yeah. to buy shirts. The concession stand was oh, super long. Why is it taking so long? Oh yeah. my god! Yeah, yeah, Kike. The parking, the parking to the concert was thirty minutes away. Oh my fucking god! Oh, you have to walk god 30 almighty! Minutes. God bless them. They're so fucking like they're justice fighters. Oh my god! Okay, it gets worse. Kike. Thirty minutes. Yeah, thirty minutes, dude. Their feet hurts when they get there, but it gets worse. Kike. They had overpriced food. <gasps> no way in a festival. Oh my yeah, god! Yeah, dude. No. Tater tots were like seventeen bucks. Oh my god! Go- yeah. Oh my god, guys. Yeah, yeah. I mean, how much was the ticket? $1,000? 20 fucking, like, 2500 bucks? Do you really think shit was expensive? Of course, you fucking idiot. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like, well, shit, I don't even have a job. I live in my, I live at home in my mom's basement, and I make YouTube videos every five minutes. How the fuck am I going to afford I, this I shit? I bought my ticket on financial aid. Oh, my God. I can't uh, go back to college. Kick it. It gets even worse, kick it. Oh my god. Because it was hot as fuck out there in California over the weekend. <laughs> what you expect? Yeah, Kike, hang on, Kike. So all these kids, they know they're not used to being out in the sun. So they had <laughs> yeah, Kike, So they, they they were struggling. They were struggling to look for shade. I'm from Seattle and I just want to be a California girl and I what the fuck? It's really hot. What the yeah, fuck? Yeah, they, so were, nice. they were all hiding behind whatever cast a shadow. <laughs> So a lot of the a lot of the concert the the venue like it looked empty yeah. because everybody was hiding in the shadows. 
So nobody, nobody, they looked like there was no crowd during the day watching the bands. <laughs> oh my god! But it's okay because eventually the sun goes down and then the big acts come out. You know, like Kanye West who bailed. Like the, the, yeah, 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 yeah. Like yeah, the yeah. big acts come out at night. You know, like Kanye West yeah, yeah, yeah. who quit two weeks ago, and yeah. like the weekend who said, "Fuck you! If you're not gonna pay me like Kanye, I ain't gonna show up." Yeah, I'm gonna and take so, a weekend off. Yeah, yeah, so everybody had to wait for fucking, you know, like Billy Eilish and all these nobodies, nobody knows yeah. and shit, and one hits and wonders. <laughs> okay. uh, Billy Eilish is pretty big, bro. <laughs> one hit wonders. But, anyways, Kiki, <laughs> anyway, it's all right. It's yeah, just, yeah, yeah. Uh, we'll, we'll see five years from now, Kiki. We'll see. All right. Yeah, She's yeah. not a no Snoop Dogg. Anyways, <laughs> it gets worse, Kiki, because when the sun went down and people got to yeah. go to the concerts, all these uh-huh. woke ass kids realized that. Their thousand dollar ticket was not enough no. to get past the railing. To get, <laughs> yeah, there's a railing, Kike, oh from the stage. There's an area that only uh, the VIPs yeah. Yeah. pay, you know, probably the 20,000 bucks and shit. Of course, because uh, it's to fucking be in this California, you fucking idiots. They get to be That's in this the little area. You live in, you idiots. Yeah, they get to be in this little area where they're really close to the stage. They're closer than the motherfuckers who waited all day and walked 30 minutes and paid for expensive food and then yeah, got yeah. sunburned in the sun. And that's all after taking like... a road trip with their friends on their mom's caravan all the way down to California to fucking Coachella and shit to get. Yep, yep, yep. So all I'm going to say is to all you pussy out motherfuckers yeah. who went to this shit, cheers! You deserve it. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you deserve all of it. For real, bro. For hey, real. Welcome to the real world, you pussies. You fucking assholes. Just wait till you actually pay for it out of your own hard work or money. Well, they're already paying for it. No, 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 no. That was their, their parents' money. All right. When they actually mm, work for it and finan- they pay for and the it. People that want to be up there, they're fucking paying with their financial aid. Oh, I just paid like $2,000 for my financial aid. I can't go back to college. Hey, can't stop showing off about your college degrees and shit. No, they're in college, dude. And fuck them, too. We're going to move on. We're not done with the loser news, Kike. Because guess oh, what? Oh, shit. What happened? Ezra Miller was arrested again on Tuesday morning at 1 a.m. He was hanging out with some motherfuckers over there in Hawaii. He's still there. Kick him more and more. They haven't kicked him out. No, 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 no. He's still there. No, I guess he's spending a lot of money. Oh, yeah. He's staying in hostels. He's paying like two bucks a day. Kick it. He's really fast. Like, he's actually fast. He's running over. <laughs> Well, he was hanging out at a party, and mm-hmm. and, and he got all mad and shit, uh, because he was he was he was being asked to leave. Yeah, you're you're too drunk. You're being crazy. You're not really the Flash. We, we want you to leave the party. And he got all mad. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. He got he all mad. Running around the fucking. Oh, am I? Oh, am I? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I saw Jason Momoa's dick and shit. He was all screaming. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He was running around, and he gets all mad, and he's all like, "Hey." I'm the fucking Flash. And he grabs a chair and he throws it at this little girl's head and fucking a big fucking gash of blood pops out because he's a big <laughs> gut and shit. So somebody calls the police. The police come and yeah. shit. And they're all like, oh, this guy he threw, a, the, the, the witnesses are saying, this guy threw a fucking chair at this little girl and shit. She was 26. Uh, you know, and this guy's 29 and shit. And so they arrest his ass and book him to jail so he can be over there woke as fuck in the, in the drunk tank. And uh, the little girl refused medical treatment. She didn't want to start no trouble. She was scared. This crackhead might come back like, to kill her. I don't, and she, she was probably passed out. Yeah. Hey, you want to press some charges? What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He gave me an autograph and said he'd kill my family if I said anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, he was released pending further investigation. Really? Wow. Why is this son of a bitch still employed? Uh, I don't know, man. I, I, I don't think he is, bro. He, I think people are talking about him like he getting fired, man. You think Warner already fired him, but they haven't publicly said that they fired him. More than likely, they're already planning it. I mean, how you know, much Kike, money have they spent uh, on this movie? They probably spent on. A, a lot of fucking money. Now that you say that, it makes sense. Think about it. The very first incident was him being on crack, going on social media, yeah. and threatening yep. to kill the KKK. That was the first. That was the first incident. 
yeah, fuck the KKK, but you can't. If you're famous and you represent a brand that represents kids and toys yeah. and media and shit, you can't be going and saying stupid shit like that. Yeah, you can't. Uh, but he did it. So that was the first offense. And I think maybe if you're right, at that moment, they fired him. And they made him sign some contract that says that he's not allowed to say he's fired. A disclosure contract, yeah. yeah. He's not allowed to say he's fired because they're going to decide when they say that he's fired because they're yeah. they're trying to figure out what the fuck they're going to do. Yeah. The whole movie's been filmed. What do we do? Yeah. And then this guy is so depressed and crazy because he got fired that he goes on a drinking crack binge in Hawaii for a mm-hmm. month. And yeah. while he's on this there drinking crack binge for a month, he fucking uh, gets arrested a bunch of times and people think he's still employed. And now Warner's <laughs> fucking crazy because they're all like, shit, he's making us look worse when we really already yeah. fired him a long time ago. What the are we going to do now? Like, we can't kick him out. I mean, he's a flash, right? <laughs> what, what do we do now? Fuck this uh, guy. Oh, my God. Discovery. Oh, yeah, yeah. Discovery. Just come out and say you fired him two months ago and that he's yeah. acting crazy because he's unstable. And that's the only reason why you, did, you fired him. No, they're saying that oh, the uh, a decision is pending, and shit. A lot of things are pending here. Man. The whole movie's like been filmed. Of... <laughs> the entire movie has been filmed. Mm-hmm. Look at the woke ass motherfucker with his crazy hair and shit. Uh, five o'clock he's... shadow and shit. Shrivel little he's white dick, fucked, dude. <laughs> I mean, he's really fucked, dude. Honestly, like his attitude is not fucking helping him at all, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not helping anybody, man. This guy's going to be crazy. Nope. We, we lost the not Flash. Not the fans, not himself. Nope. Nobody. So for, first time we had a live action Flash, and and he, and he fucks it up for us. Yeah. You realize that the only hero from the DC Universe that has ever worked out has been Batman. Superman. Yeah has failed ever since Christopher Reeve stopped being Superman. All the other Supermans mm-hmm. have sucked, apparently. Uh, Pretty much. Uh, well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Flash is fucked now. So is Cyborg. And Green Lantern has, was fucked a long time ago thanks to Ryan Reynolds and his funny, funny, <laughs> witty little ass and shit. <laughs> You know, just what I thought. I was like, they should go the Marvel way. They should go the Marvel way and get like uh, 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 people who used to do drugs in the eighties and nineties, like Johnny, like uh, Robert Downey Jr., and be like, "Hey, you, you, you need money, right? Yeah. How about we offer you Iron Man?" <laughs> Jason Momoa. I'm just waiting for Jason Momoa's meltdown. It's gonna happen soon. Oh my god. He's getting divorced know. from his wife, and he he doesn't realize what he's doing, and but pretty soon it's gonna hit him. And he's going to be, like, caught naked uh, in an orgy with, with Dick fucking, Cheney and shit. Fucking fish. With Dick, yeah, fucking a fish, a, a dolphin with Dick Cheney and shit while slitting its throat and drinking oh its blood. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, if you like shit like this, make sure you like and subscribe to our channel. And check out the full podcast on the link to the right where we discuss more topics we don't post on these short videos. Peace.